guys, welcome to a little bit of everything. Hope everyone is doing all right with all the situation of the coronavirus. Um, it's very unfortunate that it's happening to a lot of people and a lot of people are losing their family members. Um, my prayers go out to every one of you. Um, let's just keep on praying to God that hopefully this shall pass soon and we should go back to normal lifestyle that we all have. Um, but I feel that um, one of the things is that with all the situation that's going on, we need to get closer to God and just ha and just be ready because we don't we don't we don't know what could happen um, in a situation like this. We don't know if there's you know if this is the last time that we're gonna be alive. So at the same time, I feel like this is an opportunity for all of us to just join together in prayer for all those families that have lost their loved ones, for everyone that goes out to work on daily basis because they still have to work. So before I take forever on talking about this, um, I want to apologize again. I've, I haven't been constant with my videos. Um, you know, it's just, I, you know, my life has been wrapped around with so many things. And right now I've been so tied up with other things. And one of them has been seeking more of God and just having my time with him. Now this whole situation is happening. So, I mean, everybody's trying to get ready just in case if we have, we can't leave home. And so, you know, I've been doing our purchasing, like, you know, meals that won't go, you know, bad or, you know, food can, canned goods, um, you know, just, just pantry food and, um, like all that stuff that I can, you know, buy and just keep it in shelves just in case this were to happen. Go shopping, grocery shopping, and like just buy the things that you feel like won't go bad and will be, you know, on shelf for a year or two and it won't, you know, damage, it won't get damaged at all. Just because we don't know the situation, how bad this may be, may get. And, and then if they tell us that we have to be here at home and can't leave home, then, you know, that's just one of those things. And Another thing is like if this, there's a lot of restaurants that are closing. They're only doing drive throughs or, you know, delivery. But what happens if they start closing grocery stores and we can't go shopping anymore? So my advice to you is just try to take the time to make a list of the things that you may need um, in case if we have to be in in house for maybe more than two weeks. Um, just consider that. One of the ideas that I got being home and trying to like buy all this grocery stuff, I decided that I needed to clean out my refrigerator. So get rid of the old foods and stuff that are probably like all the condiments, you know, ketchup, mustard, and all those things that are probably expired. <laughs> and um, and just clean the whole refrigerator. And then um, I bought certain things from like Dollar Tree, Walmart, Ross, just to make like make my refrigerator organized. Um, you know, I feel like, you know, I needed this because for one, I mean, I feel like I run out of space and then I don't know where to put things. And when I think everything's organized, you see that you have more space available and you, you know, you can continue adding on more things. Now, I bought a lot of little uh, trays and just, just to put things in. And so it will be neat and just clean and it'll be easier for me to continue keeping it this way. So I'm gonna show you a few tips and I'm gonna show you the items that I purchased so that way, you know, you can do this yourself too. And that being said, I'm gonna show you what is the before and what is the after. So let's get started. All right, so these are the items that I purchased. Honestly, I might need more, but honestly, I feel like for now, this is good. So you guys, um, I ended up getting these, um, bottles and they they got the little chalkboard um section there we and it comes with chalk so you can actually put like juice you know orange juice or lemonade or water or whatever you want to put in these and they have a lid so it's one liter so i got two of these i got one of these just for like condiment like maybe if i do like some hot salsa salsa and i just want to put it here and it'll last longer it has a lid i got this at dollar tree this was one dollar um, you can see it's water. I mean, I just rinsed them out. I washed them and, you know, just recently cleaned them out. So, um, these right here were four, four dollars and something cents at Walmart. I got this pitcher for, um, so I can put water. You can use it as like, you can put ice in the center or like lemonade, uh, lemons and then like do lemonade. Then I got these items from Dollar Tree. Um, so these I kind of bought just in case if I, you know, I like to buy strawberries or blueberries. And, um, and I want to keep them fresh for longer. So I bought two of these from Dollar Tree. 
and I bought four of these so I can put like fruits or like yogurt or little stuff that I can keep organized. I bought myself one of these for eggs, a um, dollar. All these were a dollar each. And I bought two of these, so I'm gonna put water in it. And if I buy cilantro, you know, I can keep it more fresh with water in there and just keep them refrigerated. And I bought myself, the, I bought this from Walmart. Um, it's a beverage dispenser. Um, <clears throat> I was kind of looking for something more clear. Um, and I noticed that they had some, but it was a container that had like um, different sizes. And I kind of just thought that I just needed this for now. Um, I got this one for 12 bucks. Um, so, so yeah, I also found this little item here. Um, I love this because I can put like, you know, condiments and just turn it around. So whatever, you know, that one I have to like reach out, you know, to get some, some items, you know, I can just put it here, you know, in the entry area and then just spin it and get whatever I need. So this is cool. I got this at Ross for like four bucks or something. All right, so this is my refrigerator. As you can see, it's a mess. This is the B4 and the door. You can see everything here. It's just messy. And we're gonna go ahead and see the after. All right, finally got everything cleaned out. So before I start putting everything back in, I'm gonna go ahead and clean of the glass with the antibacterial all-purpose cleaner. And then if the glass doesn't look too clean, I'm gonna go ahead and use the glass um, surface cleaner. Finally, I finally got to finish clean the refrigerator. Oh my goodness, this took me a long time. But I finally got all the drawers washed and all of these little uh, glass dividers cleaned. So we're good to start stacking things up and putting things back in the refrigerator all organized. All right, and there you have it. My refrigerator looks so much better now. It's all clean. I feel that I might need a little bit more of these baskets just so I can put one here and maybe move these right here. Um, I, if I need more stuff to put in, should be good. Um, there's a door, less clutter, and I can go ahead and have more room for other stuff here. So basically, I feel really good about my refrigerator. Um, I can, you know, rotate. I don't even have to like reach over. A little basket for tortillas and buns and all my peppers, onions, tomatoes, all my fruits here and veggies here. Um, these containers are for fruits. I can, like I said, I can get another basket of these and then move this over and like have more room. Um, but then again, for now, I'm out just leave it here. I have my bottles of glasses ready for um, my herbs. Um, and um, I just need to put water in them. And but right now I don't have any herbs, so I just have them ready there so I can stack them once I get any my um, more groceries. So here you have it, a nice clean refrigerator. If you have any questions, comments on where to get these items, um, please um, don't hesitate to comment and I will be posting um, some of these items um, down below. So click on the error and arrow and then you can go ahead and um, see where you can find these items. Hope you enjoy this video. Till next time, bye.